Margo was a light. She was a light to her family. She was a light to her friends. She was a light to the community. She was a light to her colleagues and the students at Hill Torah. Whatever her interest, Margot's warmth was felt by all. She had a way of embracing you with her beautiful smile, her laughter, a gleam in her eyes, and a genuine sense of caring. As a friend, she would do anything and was always there for you even before I knew that I needed it. And she did it all with a smile and she was so fun and we were all so lucky to have her in our lives. No, don't you dare. I got this in the video. Thanks. <laughs> Margo and I grew up with dedication to Hillel Tara. It was always part of our lives. And when she became the director of admissions and the work she did for Hello Tara, I always heard about her dedication to them. And it was often she talked about all her work in Hello Tara. Hello Tara was not just a job for Margot. Outside of the family that she cherished, Hello Tara was her family. It was her second home and a meaningful part of her life. Well, I only worked with Margot for a short time, her love of Hello Tara made a big impression on me. Day after day, I could see the joy she got out of introducing Hill Torah to new families. Uh, just a few days before she passed away, really all she wanted to do even then was talk about what was going on in Hill Torah, how recruitment was going, and all still with a smile. She loved the school and it always shined through with everything she did. Margo was so passionate about what she did and she was there to support those around her at all times. And she never slowed down, either when others in her position might have. When I think of her, I see her walking through the hallways. She was beaming as she went into every classroom, showcasing all of the amazing things happening with the students and the teachers. And that just, encapsulated who she was. She could actually make the sun shine on a rainy day. And how apropos that this garden is being named for Margo, because what does a garden need to thrive is light. So Margo's light can shine down on everyone forever.